Today is a big day. Uh, first off, I want to start by apologizing for these geeky glasses that I'm wearing. Uh, my other one's broke, and so this is all I had. Uh, we are leaving for vacation today. Today is also the last day of school. Uh, we're heading to Florida, trying to uh, get everything ready. I'm doing some last minute running, and uh, then we're gonna wait for the kids to get out of school, and we are off to Florida. Uh, and uh, we're gonna head down close to Destin. Uh, we went there last year, got stuck in a tropical storm. It sucked, um, it rained the entire week. Uh, so we're hoping for a better uh, outcome this year. Got a lot of stuff planned. I'm just gonna kind of take you guys along and uh, just be able to look back on this. Uh, this is my way of recording the uh, video or the uh, the vacation without photos. Cause you know, like when I was a kid, like you took photos and people came over and saw like your, your pictures and you told them all about your trip. Um, and this is kind of how I'm gonna do it. And uh, hopefully my kids and me can go back and reflect on it each year and, and have good memories. And I'll uh, we'll just kind of take you guys along too. And maybe you guys will want to go to Destin. So uh, enjoy the video and here goes. So just got the Chevy Malibu. We are renting a car to take just because we don't want to take a chance of it breaking down. And uh, I was just reminded of the first time we rented a car uh, in the glove box. When we got into it, we opened it up and it was full of nachos. <laughs> Not kidding. Full of nachos. They hadn't cleaned it. It was disgusting. So every time I get in a rental car, that's the first thing I check. So I just thought that was funny. Kiddos just got home from school. You ready to go? Oh, Layla's changing. Uh, we just attacked him with water balloons. Last day of school ritual. And uh, I actually hit her, didn't mean to, but uh, so she got wet. So Nashville, here we come. We're gonna stay in Nashville tonight and then make our way to Florida the next day. So she'll be there on Wednesday. Today's Monday, today's Tuesday. <laughs> Today is Thursday, we just woke up. Uh, this is the first day we've actually woke up in our condo. We were traveling the last two days to get here. Um, yeah, we drove, uh, we drive, we, we don't fly because honestly, I don't know if we could afford to, to come on vacation and fly. So um, I just decided that I'm just gonna make videos for my family and my kids to look back and watch. Um, I'll share them with you guys just because I think it's a cool area. Maybe it's someplace you might wanna come vacation sometime. Uh, you know, I wanna uh, start off by just saying thank you to God for providing a job that allows me to come on vacation um, because without that I wouldn't be able to and um, I'm really proud that uh, we're able to uh, save the money because we have to save and we have to be strategic uh, to come on vacation but you know um, if you have any questions about where we're at or where to go um, in this area we've came the last three years and uh, we're trying to get to know it pretty awesome pretty pretty well and it's awesome so so here's the view out of our hotel not bad funny little side note this pond here we we knew there was a pond so we brought our fishing poles and this little white sign right here uh actually says that there's poisonous snakes and that uh you're not supposed to go down there and so i actually found the manager when he was out there and i was like is there really like what kind of snakes is that like water moccasins and he's like yeah like i was an idiot or something for not knowing <laughs> but i guess water moccasins are pretty uh pretty common here in florida so um cotton mouth same thing uh so i haven't seen any yet but uh we were kind of bummed because we wanted to fish but so other than that so far so good it's not raining which last year when we came there was a tropical storm the entire freaking week so uh yeah so it looks like from here i can see some of the the waves curling out there so it looks like it's gonna be a good day to go to the beach which we will do this is the entrance to the beach uh private beach access pretty cool Pretty cool little walkway. Kind of neat. Everything's gonna be alright. Everything's gonna be alright. And nobody's gotta worry about nothing. Don't go hitting that panic button. It ain't worth spilling.
as I was out swimming, look what I found. A starfish. He hasn't moved at all. A starfish. My first starfish. Caught him live out of the sea. It even hasn't moved at all. It hasn't moved at all? No, I don't really know if they move a whole lot. I don't really know a whole lot about them. I think. Day two. So I've lived in Kansas my entire life, never seen a tornado. I come to Florida and I'm just looking out over the water and I can see a tornado out in the water. You can see it right here. It's coming down. I don't know if I can zoom in enough for you to see it tearing up the water. But yeah, you can see that. Check that out. So I just got back to the hotel or the condo and uh, eating some lunch. Come to find out. Uh, there is a tropical storm. Ow, stupid toys. Uh, there's a tropical storm brewing out in the Gulf, moving towards the panhandle of Florida where we're at. And uh, it looks like it's called uh, her uh, tropical storm Roberto Alberto. This will be the third year in a row that we've uh, brought a tropical storm to Florida. So, yeah. <laughs> Well, I've officially lost two pairs of sunglasses now. Uh, I guess I should learn that the ocean will swallow you up. And I've lost two pairs of sunglasses in two days. So, no more sunglasses in the ocean for me. That's the lesson I learned today. So we just uh, got cleaned up. We're headed to uh, Seaside tonight to get some food. Uh, it's a little place we found last year that we really liked. And uh, we're gonna go get some food there and hang out, check out the beach in Seaside. And uh, it's early, it's like 5.30, so we can make it back here and walk around and hang out at our beach too. But uh, Seaside's what, maybe 15, 15 minute drive from here. What'd you get, man? Dog. Uh -huh. Hot dog. Hot dog. behind me is the van where there was a lady when I was backing up she walked behind me and then decided to chew me out in some language I couldn't understand 
But uh, somehow she was mad at me for backing up when I was still in the car, and I don't know quite what she was doing or why, but it was weird. Well, we're home. I uh, didn't really show you guys the traveling back. Didn't think you wanted to see a bunch of footage of us driving and uh, it's kind of boring. Uh, so I just wanted to uh, just kind of kind of end the video, I guess, by saying it was a great vacation. Uh, Tropical Storm Alberta was moving in. So we, uh, we left a little bit early and just kind of enjoyed our time uh, getting back and kind of getting settled in and, and uh, getting groceries, getting the car back and just kind of getting I guess ready for work and uh, you know it just feels good I got a lot of rest didn't work out at all while we were there uh, honestly didn't even didn't even put on tennis shoes uh, from the time we left to the time there I, I wore flip-flops and didn't exercise saw a lot of people exercising uh, was a little tempting a few times but I'm glad that we rested and spent time with the family and again I made this video for my kids and, and Shanna and I just want to say that I love you guys and uh, hopefully we'll be able to go back and reflect on this vacation for a long time and this is just kind of my way of making a photo album I guess and uh, I'll share with you guys as well anybody watching here on YouTube and if you guys have any questions about where we're at or where we went uh, or suggestions let us know we do a lot of exploring while we're there and uh, so hopefully we could give you guys some pointers and um, just want to say thanks to everybody for watching the video and thanks to all the clients for uh, you know just being cool uh, while we were gone and taking care of the gym and and letting us get away and recoup and and reflect and just kind of get rejuvenated and uh, I think we did that and so looking forward to getting back to it and just want to say thank you to everybody and uh, especially to my family and my uh, my wife Shanna I love you guys so much and uh, many more vacations to come see you guys on the next one